Using the Calculate app of a Casio FX8200AU, a range of trigonometric calculations can be performed to evaluate expressions, to obtain both exact and approximate results, and to help us solve trigonometric equations. To open the Calculate app from the home screen, press OK or Execute. Enter cosine 5 pi over 6 via the cosine key followed by the fraction template using shift and 7 to enter pi, then using the arrow keys and brackets to finish off. Closing the brackets is not strictly essential in this case, but is generally good practice. Pressing Execute, the 8200 provides us with an exact value. If we require an approximate value, instead press Shift and Execute. To help us solve this trigonometric equation, the 8200 can be used to calculate the arctan of negative root 3 via the Shift and the Tan key along with the radical template. This command will output the angle closest to zero with a tangent value of negative root 3. As the solution is outside the given domain, with a little thought about the unit circle, a solution to this equation can be obtained by adding pi to this result using shift and 7 to enter pi. Equivalent calculations to these can be performed in terms of angles measured in degrees. With the 8200 still set to the angle unit of radians, cosine 150 degrees can be evaluated. To enter the degrees symbol, press the catalogue key, the one with the book on it, arrow down and press OK to open the angle slash coordinate slash sexagesimal settings, then press OK to enter degrees, then OK to finalise the calculation. If we require an approximate value, instead press Shift and Execute. Alternatively, the 8200's global angle setting can be changed to degrees. To do this, press the settings key, press OK to open the calculator settings, arrow down and right to open the angle unit, and then press OK to set the calculator to degrees. With this done, use the back arrow to return to the calculation screen, then find the arc tangent of negative root 3, measured in degrees. Add 180 degrees to this output to obtain a solution to the equation in the domain provided.